Hi, and welcome to the training video series on the child care attendance community. My name is Jeremy Brown, and today I want to show you how to send a pin activation or initiate the pin activation for the parent. And then we'll review the steps on how to reset your pin. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, as promised from the introduction, I want to review with you the steps on what you need to do as a provider to send a PIN activation to a parent through their email. So the first thing you need to do is you need to locate this private pay child and their parent who still needs a PIN activated. So let's go ahead to our children list here on the children icon. I know this child's record needs a pin activation, so I'm going to go ahead and detail in with the chevron right here. I'm going to go to the household tab, and you'll see that the primary is already active under the pin status. However, the pin status is pin not sent under the secondary. So I'm going to go ahead and send to my email and show you as a provider what you need to do is just select this paper plane icon. This pin status will remain pending until that parent updates the email. Okay, so I just received the email here um, from the provider community. As a parent, what I need to do is I need to verify that this is my name. I'm going to go in and activate the pin by one of two ways. I can either select here on this hyperlink where it says click here, or I can copy and paste this uh, URL in my browser. I'm going to go ahead and select click here. Let's go ahead and update a brand new pin. Go ahead and select new reset. And now your pin has been successfully changed. So we're back in the provider community. I just want to verify that this pin has been changed. I'm going to go ahead and go locate my child list. I'm going to go to the child's record who I just sent that pin for. Let's go to the household tab on the top right. And now you'll see that the paper plane icon is gone and now the pin status is active. And that is how you send a pin from the provider community to a parent. So to do this, we're gonna go ahead and go to the main menu. We're gonna select on kiosk. And from here, what you want to do is you want to select forgot pin. Once you have input that, an email has now been sent to you providing you with the instructions to reset your pin. And that is how you reset your pin as a provider as a parent or delegate. Thanks for watching guys.